look in this video there's something simple we are going to create and it's all about trying to transform a simple image into an epic image inside of canva okay and i'll be teaching you the whole process so make sure you don't go anywhere stick to this video to the end because i realize a lot of times you don't stick to the end of this video my name is benjamin and let's jump straight into it okay so we are first of all just going to come here and to create a design and we'll just search for any dimension of your choice okay so i would use the 1080 by 1350 okay and here we have it inside of canva so just allow everything to load beautifully to use the same image i'm using there's the link in the description box below all right very easy and very simple so i'll just come here into my uploads first of all and i should find the image okay so this is the image we are simply going to use a very simple image i'll right click come to set image as background and I actually found this image on pinterest so yeah just in case you want to know where i found it from anyway now that we have this image it's looking flat at the moment even though you can tell it's been edited and all of that but since we brought it in canva it looks flat so what we are going to do is come to edit okay in edit we want to punch up some of the colors so the first thing we want to do is to increase the brightness which would increase the light in the image and just make the overall image um, brighter okay then the contrast to create extra separation from the bright and dark version um, part of the image okay then highlight focuses on you know the additional light we have in the image so you can see it's focusing on just this part you know where we have light okay so the highlights yeah in shadows would only focus on the shadows or the darker parts you can increase the blacks but i think since we've adjusted the shadows there's no need for this okay then saturation you know it punches up all the colors in the image okay and the vibrance increases the colors that are a bit low okay so you can see the additional colors that are not too bright and vibrance will just raise them up so that they can just have some pop all right i don't know if i'm explaining things are working but i just hope they are okay so now that we are done all we can just do is press t on your keyboard we want to add some text okay so i can see epic editing okay so epic and we'll just increase the size and i'll just change this to all caps okay then we'll just also change the font all right so i would use this font champion gothic but you can use any font of your choice there's league gothic which we have over here you can also use league gothic okay so that's what you can do so i said champion editing or epic edit but i'll just see epic touch okay so t-o-u-c-h and this is what we have at the moment now to make this match we want to make a match with what we have over here so we'll just come to text color and i'll just come to add color and i'll use the color picker so i'll just pick this and you can see how it looks if you want to use the golden color you can just pick from a golden standpoint but i think um if it's something like this yeah it's fine i think this is fine then we come to effect choose neon okay and you can see what is happening over here okay if you want to do something extra you can just you know, duplicate this and change the color to a brighter color okay so you can just pick the color from another point and you see what we have at the moment okay now that we have this let's come back into element and let's search for smoke okay so smoke you have so many smokes over here so you can just add okay this is an interesting smoke we can put this here i don't want it to overlap the curtains okay else it would look that eh, you know things ain't looking too good so we just want to keep it within this area okay then come to edit and we are going to use dual tone it's a long time i actually use dual tone i just okay anyway enough of the talking scene <laughs> okay then we are just going to pick the color you can see what we are doing and you can either choose a bright color or that color depending on what works okay so this works so i'll just copy the code come to the shadow and paste it over here as well okay so this is what we have at the moment and you can add as many shadows or smokes of your choice okay we have this one as well which is looking real smoky okay so we can put this here and maybe put this here something like that all right and first of all we can just write the copy star and paste it here okay so that we avoid any additional editing whatsoever 
okay then we have this one here i would want i would want to put this here okay so something like this i can copy the style and i can paste it here you see what we have created over here then we can add maybe this shadow as well why do i keep saying shadow when there are smokes okay so we have this one as well we'll increase it over here and this is fine then i want to add one visible sh um smoke i almost said shadow okay so one okay so something like this and i'm just going to reduce the size and yeah reduce the size just like this and i'll put it over here okay then i can still right click copy the style and paste it here and i would also reduce the transparency okay so something like this is also fine okay then if we want the text to feel like they are touching the ground you can just you know drop them here you know just drop them down a little bit okay and make sure that what's behind is also following okay so you can simply press and hold control and click multiple times to access it or you can just come to right click come to layer show layers and also select what you have behind okay depending on where it is okay so i think this is it and i'll bring it down as well and this is what we have at the moment so you can see how we've been able to transform a very simple image into an epic looking image and i hope you found it this is just a casual tutorial i just created in canva nothing serious just to create um, something cool for you with vibes okay so i hope you enjoyed it the name is benjamin always remember there is no limit to creativity check out all my templates and canva proof of in the description box below mm -hmm.